Hello everyone, CY here, and in this video I'm going to be showing you some very very simple scripting. It's very very simple scripting indeed. Uh, this one's going to be one of the most simple and most used scripts around, uh, except there's going to be a lot of variations to them, and I'll go through a couple with you today. Okay, so scripting is a very very intriguing aspect of the game that um, allows you to do basically what your mind wishes, uh, just if you can script it correctly. And um, the thing we're going over today is uh, transaction scripts. They're extremely simple, uh, but can get complicated the more varying, vary the, <coughs> the more variation you put into it. If, that, if that's a thing, I don't know. I can't English today. This is going well. Okay, so the first thing we're going to want to do is we're going to go and want to go into the scripting area, which is in your menu you can click scripts. Now here is the uh, the the modes that you can run with your existing scripts, which should be down here in your um. In your, ex in your existing scripts area, you can also change it to edit so that if you click the script that you already have, uh, you can edit it in any way you would like. And also the delete mode, which you can just click, 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 and just delete any one you want with ease. Right, so we're going to make a new script, obviously. So uh, we're going <laughs> to name this script. Uh, for some reason, I've made eight scripts already, but I haven't. That's a bug. I don't know. All right, so what are we going to name this script? We'll name it trans... Oh, hold on. <laughs> I'll get that. <coughs> Hold on. <coughs> there we go. <laughs> I'm such a noob. Right. So um, when it comes to scripting, uh, we're going to want to think of it as a human being. So the first thing we're going to want to talk about when we talk about human beings is their ambition. Their ambition is um, where they want to be in order for them to achieve their goal, if you get what I mean. So what we're going to want to do is we're going to type in, uh, we're going to use what's called an if. So an if means what if. So this is the dreaming part. This is what uh, they do in their sleep. This is what humans do in their sleep. Like, what if this happened? Like, and they dream of it. So this is the goal that they want to get to. So we're going to do like if, uh, uh, we're going to go if, well, for some reason the uh, XYZ and actor, um, uh, like it, it should say player, but I don't know. They they must have removed that or just replaced it with player. Uh, we're gonna say gold. So obviously, gold pieces. Wait, we'll say gold pieces. Uh, and then we'll. Uh, this bit is the easiest part, which is the equal to or more than or le less than or equal to. It's really weird. So the uh, if you remember crocodile teeth in your class back in I don't know whatever grade you was in or whatever year you was in. Uh, you'll notice that this one means less than, this one means greater than, and this one means equal oh. <coughs> that means plus, and this one means equal to. So um, you can combine them also. So what you can do is um, I want to do equal to or more than. Smiley face, basically. I call it the smiley face. Alright, so, and then we're going to do, let's say 100 gold. So you have 100 gold. So if player, sorry, if has inventory, player. Uh, gold pieces equal to more than 100 gold coins. So that means you can have either 100 gold coins or more. And then the if, this big if here, oh, this big if will have been achieved. So uh, the if is the part that the player needs to achieve in order for the next part to happen. So what you can do is you can type in a then. A then is the, oh my god, this actually happened. Now what am I going to do? So this is the, um, obviously, the then. So oh, this is the action part of the script. So what you're going to do is you're going to type in, uh, what, what should we give him? So if inventory, if, if inventory player has, <laughs> sorry, that's complete gibberish. If player has inventory gold coins equal to or more than 100, then I guess we can, it's a transaction script. So we're going to, we're going to take away whatever he's got actually. We'll just, uh, oh, we'll just, oh, ah, I'm not, <coughs> there we go. <laughs> so I've just copied and pasted it. So, um, we'll do, uh, takes away, oh, we're not going to do a has inventory. Um, the then, with the has inventories, you just do inventory, if that makes sense. Uh, because if has inventory, you don't mean then has inventory. So, 
so what you would do is you would go to player, then gold pieces, then you would go take gold pieces, because it, it is a transaction script. So we're going to get rid of the exact um, gold pieces that you wanted to take away, and what should we give him? Um, well, actually, we'll paste that again. Oh, and we'll, uh, we'll type add. Uh, actually, we won't give him gold pieces because otherwise we're transacting it for transacting. <laughs> we're transacting it for giving him gold pieces. All right, so what we're going to give him? Nah, let's give him a wood pickaxe. I I think there's uh, a space needs to be in there also. Gold pieces is one entity, so it needs to be the same. If you get what I mean, uh, it's kind of weird. All right, so add one. We'll add one gold wood pickaxe. And also we need to get rid of the has, because the has is a... Uh, that. Alright. Okay, so what we can do now is we can go into our shop and grab ourselves a script block and switch. You can use a button as well, but I use a script personally. And uh, we'll just need to place the script block... Oops. <coughs> we just need to place these down. I, I also uh, like to disguise my script block as a crate or something something along those lines to basically hide the fact that it is script block it's, it's pretty all right so we can then go into the script block and we can turn powered on so we can use the transaction script so the transaction script will um happen if the power if the script block is turned on now the script block is only turned on when this button is flipped up it's green okay so when it's red and it's off it's green it's off all right it's pretty simple all right, so what we can do now is we can give ourselves some gold. So let's give ourselves some gold. Let's give ourselves... Oh, God, that's a lot of gold. <laughs> that's uh, 64k. Uh, we we'll probably don't need that much, but we'll, we'll go on with it anyways. All right, so what we can do now is we can click the switch, and it takes 100 gold off us, because we had 64,000 to begin with. It took 100 gold off, off us and gave us a wood pickaxe. So that's really simple. Okay, so now you're thinking... Well, what if I only have one gold coin? So let's flip the switch if it has one gold coin. It doesn't do anything, but it doesn't tell us that we like don't have anything. So what we can do is we can go into our script, and we can click Edit Script, Transaction Script. So now what we need to do is we need to put an if in there to tell us that we don't have enough money. So what we can do is we can... Uh, we need to do it above. So we'll do some inserts to get it on top. We'll if has inventory. Oh, that has history. Rip. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, there we go. I fixed it. <laughs> All right. So, but then we click. Then, uh, then we go. Let's let's tell him. Let's let's just tell the person that they uh, don't have enough money. So what we can do is we can use what's called a notify. A notify is literally a little notice that'll pop up on the top left of your screen, and it'll just give you whatever text you want to give it. So I'm just going to put 60, 60, 60. This is the uh, the color scheme in which it will give it to you in. I do 60, 60, 60 because I like it fairly black, but I don't like it per uh, like fully black. All right. So, and then what we're going to do is we're going to do local because otherwise people can spam it. So um, what we're going to say is you don't have enough. If I can spell <coughs> bruh, money, you don't have enough money. And we, because uh, it says that we don't have enough money, uh, it will just end the script there, uh, which is kind of weird. So what we need to do is we need to change uh, this. Oh, we need to change this if to an else. Okay, so this is a very, very basic transaction script. Let's test it. So what we can do now is we can click this. Oh, the other button. <coughs> and it says you don't have enough money. Yes, we need to trade that little, tiny little inconspicuous gold coin and get a stack. And then we can just continuously spam ourselves with wood pickaxes. Hello, thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, please like and subscribe. It would help us a lot as we've just started the channel. And from the Dig Deeper team, see you in the next video.